Hey everyone, welcome to my kitchen. I'm Jason. Today we're going to make garbage can nachos. So if you've had these in restaurants, you'll know that they have a special can to make these. We're going to use a 105 ounce can of crushed tomatoes we got from Sam's Club. Less than four bucks. Um, we're going to take the ingredients out and we're going to make pizza sauce out of this later. If you're interested in that recipe, check down in the description. So first thing we're going to do is we are going to empty this out, wash it out, and we'll start putting the ingredients in. Okay, we're going to make a cheese roux for our nachos. So we're going to heat this up on a low to medium heat, two tablespoons of butter, two tablespoons of flour. We're going to let that cook up until the flour taste is gone. Okay, as you can see, our flour and butter is coming together, getting slightly brown. I'll take that off the heat. We're going to add one cup of milk. And we're going to bring that back to a simmer. Okay, as you can see, that's been simmering and it's starting to thicken up. We're going to turn that heat way down. We're going to add in cheese a little at a time and mix that in. By the way, the entire recipe is down in the description box. And I added just a little bit more milk. It was getting a little bit thick. Now I'm going to add a little bit of cayenne pepper to add a little bit of heat, maybe half a teaspoon, and a little bit of cumin. Give that a stir. And there's a good look at this delicious cheese sauce that's going to go on our nachos. Okay. Let's put this together. Okay, we have our cheese sauce done. There's our can, like you can see, ready to put chips in. So we're going to put some chips in first. And next we're going to put a little bit of cheese sauce. pickled jalapenos, some diced Roma tomatoes, a little bit of raw jalapenos, some cilantro, then we're just going to keep repeating that process. And I almost forgot, we're going to use this smoked barbecue pork that we made last weekend. You can use chicken, seasoned taco meat, anything you choose. So. I'm going to put this in there and we're just going to keep on repeating layers and then uh, stay tuned. You get to see what it looks like when we pull it apart. Next is the exciting part. Mm -hmm. So here's the exciting part. I'm going to take a plate, put it over the top, we'll do a little flipperoo and see what kind of mess we can make. Ooh, 
There we go. So we're going to put some extras on top and put some cilantro. Put a dab of sour cream. Dab of guacamole. And we'll put a little bit of salsa on top as well. So all the layers are all put together. It's cheesy, oozy, and good. Delicious. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and uh, we'll see you next time.